Hi, my name is Jennifer Nichols and I teach everything I learn about Procreate to you. I have a wonderful membership. If you're interested, the link is down below. Today I want to show you how to get your sketch or inked layer off of a piece of paper. <laughs> so if you've been sketching in a journal or a notebook and you want to bring it into Procreate, I would take a photo or a scan and then bring that image into Procreate. So I have sort of duplicated that. I did do this in Procreate, but I went ahead and attached my sketch to this colorful paper. And I would hope that you probably aren't sketching on such dark paper, but I wanted to show you this as the example. So I have this layer that's got my sketch and the paper all in one, and I'm just gonna duplicate it so I have my original and turn my original off. So duplicating is swiping to the left, tapping duplicate there. And now I need to get that to be white. So the first thing I'm gonna do is come over here to the adjustments menu and go to hue, saturation, brightness, and turn the saturation all the way down so that I don't have any of that yellow that's in there. And now I have completely grayscale, so I can exit out of there, go back in and go to curves now. And this works because it's grayscale. I'm gonna zoom in so you can see my sketch. I did do my sketch with a pencil -y brush, so it should be similar to if you had done this on, on real paper. And I'm looking at this white background and I'm looking at this gray background and I'm just gonna slide this node over that way. I'm also watching my sketch because if this isn't a rough sketch, if it's more of a finalized sketch that you're actually gonna use in your art, you wanna make sure that you maintain that sketch the way that you're intending it to look um, or an inked layer. So if you just keep an eye on your sketch, even the lighter pieces over here and start sliding this node. You're going to see the background lightening up and I'm comparing it to the white here. And it's basically white now. You can see it right there. It goes to white. Hopefully that's showing up on camera. And my sketch looks basically the same, but if it lightened a little bit and you can also kind of scooch around and see, this is a rough sketch. You can see all my little doodles here you can kind of grab over here and darken it. So let me zoom out a little bit so you can see a little bit more and you can grab a node and darken the sketch. So I didn't grab a node, I grabbed the line and it created a node, but um, you can darken the sketch or the ink layer if you want. And you need to kind of watch and make sure you've still got a white background and you like the way your whole thing looks and then you can exit. So we still just have black and white. We still are attached. If you turned your background to a darker color, you can see that that sketch is still attached to that layer, but now it's kind of just like, we just made sure it was very white. So if your photo or scan did do a really good job making your background white, then you don't need to do that part. All right, so now I am gonna tap on that layer and tap copy. And I'm going to add a fresh layer and go turn it black. So I'm going to double tap here down in black and just drag and drop that whole layer is black. All right, now I'm going to tap on the black layer and create a layer mask. So I tap mask and now I'm automatically on that layer. You can see it's brighter and I'm going to three finger swipe down since I already copied and paste. All right, so now we have that image on the mask. But now I need to tap that and tap invert. There we go. And then just merge those down, merge those together. All right, so let me turn off this original white layer. It's not original anymore. This one's the original, but the one we turned white. And now you can see your sketch is its own layer. You can test it out and make sure you did a good job by changing the background. And there you've done it. I know it's hard to see when I'm in dark mode. It's hard to see the sketch in there, but you can see that it's its own layer. And now you can do whatever you want with that being on its own layer. There's a lot of reasons that I won't go into. Have fun. So real quick recap, desaturate, go into curves and lighten the background. Possibly add another node to darken your sketch again. Create a, a black layer 
add a layer mask to that layer, copy this, paste it onto the layer mask, invert, and then merge. <laughs> it will get easier, but write down those steps and um, you'll, once you, if you have to use this a lot, if you like to sketch on paper, it will get easier. This is actually a sketch from my membership. Um, we did a fun project and had these cute little shelves with coffee and tea themes and learned how to illustrate them, learned how to create a mood board and um, get inspired by all sorts of free use images and then had fun illustrating. Uh, come and join me over my membership. I have a private community where I give lots of one-on-one -on -one help and we have live lessons all the time, ten dozens of classes for you to choose from and I'll see you there hopefully. Sign up for my newsletter and you get a coupon code too for the membership. Bye.